Hi, I'm Lisa Almeida, the Bodanista, and I'm the franchise owner for Freedom Boat Club, Jacksonville, St. Augustine, and Julington Creek. And I am a born and raised Floridian, and I love boating. So I'm super excited because we worked with Boat Trader on a stomping grounds episode for my neighborhood and all of our boating. And we have third generation people who have grown up boating. Now the kids are living here and they're all experiencing that together. And it was so much fun to be with Boat Trader and to share that experience. And so a few weeks later, Boat Trader reached out and they said, we have this partnership with Kicker Audio and we need a pontoon boat to put a sound system in. I didn't even have to think twice. The answer was yes. So Boat Trader, Kicker Marine Audio are on their way right now to come pick up the boat. They're gonna take it to Daddio's and get my brand new pumping stereo system put in. I cannot wait. So we got Lisa's boat here today to Daddio's, one of Kicker Marine Audio's authorized dealers here in Jacksonville, Florida. And we're going to talk with Andy, who's been working on the installation all day, so that you can better understand what can go into upgrading a sound system on your boat. So we're here with Andy, who's been working on the installation on Lisa's boat, and he's been working at Daddio's for 16 years now. Yes, ma'am. So you know sound systems. Yes, ma'am, I do. So tell us about how you help people make their selections for their sound systems when they want to do an upgrade. Obviously, first, come out and assess the boat, see what we have going on, then make the recommendations. Kicker is usually my first recommendation because the quality of the product and the variety of products that they offer. This new line I'm very impressed with, so I would highly recommend it. So you did install the new KMXL coaxial speakers. Yes, and these speakers have taken Kicker's proprietary horn-loaded technology and compressed it into a coaxial. This was formerly available in the cone tower speakers, but now you're able to put this inside the boat. Yes, ma'am. Sounds and amazing. You were impressed with the sound. Yes, very today. impressed, very impressed. So what other things did you help Lisa in making her plan for the boat? Uh, well, we changed out everything that came in here stock. We replaced everything, the head unit, the four speakers. We even added a subwoofer, which I know she's going to love. And it's a 12-inch one, yes, right? Yes, it is. We could, we could really hear yes, that. it booms. Um, and we also added a five-channel amp, uh, which is really going to bring out the audio. And that subwoofer, like I said, it's, it's like over the top right now. She's going to enjoy that. So that was a big upgrade for this yes. boat, and it's going to make it a real party pontoon. Exactly. <laughs> now, what other things do you look for in the installation? I know that Kicker also has a proprietary wire system that they recommend using, and they even extend the warranty on their equipment when you use that wiring harness. That's correct, yes. And we actually ran Kicker uh, four gauge, oxygen-free copper, marine grade wire, front to back in this boat, everything, speakers, uh, power wire, everything. Even the RCAs are also OFC. So it's an upgrade all the way around. Well, and Kicker calls it real marine because they do so much work in the design and the construction of them to make sure that they are watertight and that they are durable and coated with Santa Prine and the way they do even their wire mountings that are waterproof, it really enhances the durability of the product. Yes, ma'am, it does. So in looking at the other things that you had to modify on this boat to make those changes, you had to cut an extra hole for the subwoofer which is a free air one, but now it could be either in a compartment or it can be open. Correct. So, so you... that new sub, it is free air, but you could also mount it in an enclosure as well. And as you see, we mounted it enclosed and it sounds amazing. And something else that somebody might have to consider is like when you replace the head unit, it was a different shape than the prior one. Correct. So you fabricated a new plate for the helm so that it would fit in and look good as That's well. Right. Yes, ma'am, we did. I recreated the bezel to a whole new bezel and it looks awesome. And that's why you go to a professional to get your installation <laughs> yes, done. Do. So how happy are you with the work that you did today? Oh God, from one to 10, 10. 
Definitely oh, a 10. Good to hear. Yes, ma'am. So Lisa should be happy when we get this boat tour tomorrow. She's going to be ecstatic. Boat Trader and Kicker Marine Audio just brought my boat back. I am so excited about getting on the water and trying out the sound system. My friends are coming over and we are going to be dancing on the water. What an incredible sound system. I finally got a subwoofer and an amp that really pumps. And when I am out at the sandbar or on my boat, there's going to be no question who's got the music playing and who's in control of the music. So music on the water is extremely important. And having that sound system on a pontoon boat, because on a pontoon boat, you've got so much room for all the people. And for someone who loves to dance, you've got plenty of room to dance. So you need that really good, sharp sound system that just is gonna make everybody just wanna get up and jump for joy when they hear their favorite song. So on the pontoon boat, we had a sound system that was maybe a little bit tired and could be replaced. And so to have something like Kicker Audio that's really gonna pump, be clear and loud all at the same time, this will accomplish that. Thank you, Boat Trader. Thank you, Kicker Marine Audio, for a really awesome kicking system.